English for Iraq 6th Primary by Sarah McBurney Copyright Garnet Publishing Limited 2018 Welcome pupils, how are you today? I'm very glad to meet you. Uh, today I'm going to start with Unit 2. We're going to start with Unit 2. Lesson 1. Lesson 1. Lesson 1. Primary School. English for Iraq. The primary. The lesson is presented by Ms. Ban Saleh Mustafa. So uh, we will uh, study Unit 2, Lesson 1. Or we will start with Lesson 1 of Unit 2 in your pupil's book, pages 22 and 23. So open your books on these pages. I'm I'll going I'm going to explain lesson one of unit two. Uh, we will study in this lesson. We will study this statement. It is made of. It is made of. So the aims of the lesson. to study the materials. The materials. So they include wood, al khashab, wool means a saw, cotton, al qut, leather, al jil, rubber, al matar, denim, qimash uh, qutni, glass, al zujaj, and metal, al madan. So we will study the materials. We use the materials to make things. Also, we will study adjectives. Wooden and woolen. Wooden, khashabi. Woolen, sufi. We will study household objects, some household objects, such as jug, saucepan, pencil case, knife, sikin, spoon, bottle. اللي هو البطل أو هنسمينا قارورة زجاجية. Also we will study clothing. رح ندرس بعض الملابس such as boots, ال 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 boot ال ال الشتوي, sweater, ال blues, t-shirt يعني t-shirt الصيفي, jeans يقصد بينه البنطلون الجينز, shoes الحذاء, gloves والقفازات, dress الفستان Bands, أربطة مطاطية. Jacket, jacket. Skirt, تنورة. And rain boots, البوت المطري. Then هذه we will study some clothing. And also we have this grammatical uh, questions or information. What's or what are the, uh, for example, the skirt made of? It is made of or they are made of. Then هذا كان the aims of the lesson. هذا هو الهدف من من الدرس الأول في الوحدة الثانية Unit Two Lesson One. Uh, open your books on uh, before we start to the lesson. So we have the materials, the materials. يعني مواد التصنيع. The materials. This is our lesson today. We will talk about the materials. What are the materials that we are going to study? Uh, we have cotton, القطن. Uh, we have wool. Asuf, wool. Also, we have wood, al khashab, wood, al khashab. We have leather, al jil, leather. Uh, we have a glass, al zujaj, glass. And also, we have metal, al madan, something is metal, such as saucepan, any shape madani, mafmoa min al madan. Maybe, yani, it, it, it is not, it means iron specifically. No, it is any. Any metal, any madam. Also, we have denim, denim, uh, and uh, we have finally rubber, al matar. So, all of these are the materials that we will study in lesson one, and we use these materials to make things. So, begin with the lesson one here in your book. Open your books on page, uh, pages 22 and 23. You are listen one of unit two. Listen one of unit two. It's made of. إنه مصنوع من. It's made of. It means it's made of material. 
إنه مصنوع من مادة الصنع. The activity A we have listen, اصغي, look, انظر, and say. وقل. Listen, look, and say. We have pictures of many things in the here in the top part of this page. We have uh, pictures of many things. They are made of different materials. And you have the صور اللي أمامي في أعلى الصفحة. هذه تمثل صور لعدة أشياء. ومنها ملابس، منها أشياء منزلية. Uh, some uh, of them are clothes, and others are uh, um, uh, something or household objects. So, and what are the, they made of? من إيش مصنوعة هذه الأشياء؟ إذا listen, look, and say. So if we come to picture number one, I will ask about uh, the t-shirt. What is it made of? What is it made of? What's it made of? Min mada So it is, it's a cotton t-shirt. It's a cotton t-shirt. Innahu t-shirt qutni. Idan wasaftu t-shirt bi huwa qutni. A cotton t-shirt. So it's a t-shirt. And it's a cotton t-shirt. It's made of cotton. إنه مصنوع من القط. What about number two? We have a woolen sweater. A woolen sweater. Uh, it means uh, blues sufi. A sweater, يعني blues, woolen, sufi. Then I describe the sweater. I say it's a woolen sweater. إنه blues sufi. Number three, we have leather boots. What's it, what are they made of? What are they made of? They are made of leather. So they are leather boots. They are leather boots. Even here, boot uh, chindi. Number four. What are they made of? What are they made of? And trousers here. We have, uh, they are denim jeans. They are denim jeans. يعني uh, هو جينز من القماش القطني جينز يعني بنطلون جينز من القماش القطني اللي هو دينم نمبر 5 here what are they made of من ماذا مصنوعة هذه rubber rain boots rubber rain boots يعني بوت مطري مطاط rubber rain boots بوت مطري مطاط now six we have what's it made of what's it made of it's a wooden spoon it's a wooden spoon إنها ملعقة خشبية spoon يعني ملعقة wooden يعني خشبية إذن it's a wooden spoon إنها ملعقة خشبية it's made of wood number seven what's it made of لماذا مصنوع هذا a metal saucepan. It's a metal saucepan. إنه قدر معدني. A metal, metal يعني معدن. Saucepan يعني قدر أو مقلات. It's a, a metal saucepan. إنه uh, قدر معدني. And finally, number eight. What's it made of? لماذا مصنوع الجاج? It's a glass jug. A glass jug. إنه uh, جرة. Zujajia, uh, a glass jug. Even so, after we uh, write the names and the, the pictures for these things, we describe uh, also the material for each item. So uh, the t shirt is made of cotton, the uh, the sweater is made of wool, here they are. The boots are made of leather. They are. So we say they are leather boots. They are made of leather. What are they made of? They are made of denim. What are the rain boots made of? They are made of rubber. While what is the spoon made of? ماذا مصنوعة الملعقة؟ It is made of wood. إنها مصنوعة من الخشب. And what is the saucepan made of? It is made of metal. 
إنه مصنوع من المعدن Finally, what is the jug made of? ماذا مصنوع هذه الجرة? It is made of glass إنها مصنوعة من الزجاج إذا لاحظ مواد التصنيع Cotton, القط Wool, الصوف Leather, الجلد Denim, قماش قطني Rubber, المطار Wood, الخشب Metal, المعدن And finally glass, it means الزجاج إذا كان هذا عندي في uh, activity or the first activity. Now listen to track to make sure from the answers. Track 16. Listen, look, and say. 1. What's it made of? It's a cotton t-shirt. 2. What's it made of? It's a woolen sweater. 3. What are they made of? They're leather boots. 4. What are they made of? They're denim jeans. 5. What are they made of? They're rubber rain boots. 6. What's it made of? It's a wooden spoon. 7. What's it made of? It's a metal saucepan. 8. What's it made of? It's a glass jug. After we uh, listen to track uh, 16, so make sure from your answers, and as you can see these words the picture, a cotton t-shirt, a woolen sweater, leather boots, leather boots, man haphoni la a wala an, denim jeans, also here don't put a or an because they are plural, rubber rain boots, rubber rain boots, a wooden spoon, honey haphoni to a and mufrad, a wooden spoon, a metal saucepan, also here singular, we say a, a metal saucepan, and finally, a glass jug, يعني, uh, جرة زجاجية. Now, in the second activity, you say match the pictures and the phrases. طابق الصور بالعبارات الموجودة في هذه inside the boxes and write the numbers inside the squares. واكتب أرقام الصور داخل المربعات. So, number one here, first glass jug. Glass jug, it refers to picture A. إذن هذه راح نطابقة مع الصورة رقم 8 wooden spoon wooden spoon it, it refers to picture 6 إذن هذه تشير إلى uh, picture 6 you should write 6 inside the square leather boots leather boots البوت الجلدي this uh, sentence refers to picture 3 leather boots هذا هو البوت الجلدي Leather boots طبعا هوني Boots هذه تؤخذ بصيغة الجمع لازم دائما تكون بصيغة الجمع Plural Boots Also here uh, Rubber rain boots أيضا تؤخذ بصيغة الجمع لازم أضيف S الجمع وعندي Jeans Denim jeans أيضا هذه تكون بصيغة Plural لازم أضيف S الجمع Metal saucepan Metal saucepan القدر المعدني It refers to picture 7 so you should write number seven inside the square. Rubber rain boots. Boot al-matari al It refers to picture five. You should write five inside the square. Woolen sweater. Loose, sufi. Hadi, it refers to picture two. Hadi, tshir ila sura rakm etnin. Cotton t-shirt. Cotton t-shirt. A t-shirt al-qutni. This refers to picture one. هذه تشير إلى الصورة رقم واحد وعندي finally denim jeans denim jeans الجينز القطني هذه راح تشير إلى uh, four picture four now in this box we should remember احنا يجب أن نتذكر which nouns are singular one thing it means uh, these pictures some of them are singular and others are plural. بعض هذه الصور هي في حالة المفرد وبعضها تكون في حالة الجمع. 
إذن he say which which nouns أي الأسماء وردت في هذه الصور are singular مفردة means one thing write the numbers of the pictures we have number one اللي ورد عندي بصيغة المفرد هو one اللي هو t-shirt number two اللي هو sweater one only a sweater singular uh, number six six اللي هو spoon only singular one spoon we have seven who was saucepan القدر المعدني is also it is uh, singular and finally eight who was jug is also singular so the nouns are singular or one thing uh, are uh, the pictures one two six seven eight you should write these numbers in the squares انتم لازم تكتبون هذه الارقام عندكم داخل مربعات فهو يقول which nouns اي الاسماء are singular مفردة one thing it means يعني شيء واحد but here which nouns اي الاسماء are plural اي الاسماء وردت بصيغة الجمع it means more than one thing اكثر من شيء واحد يعني نعامل معاملة الجمع we have the pictures four four اللي هي عندي jeans jeans قلنا يؤخذ بصيغة الجمع هذا لازم دائما نكتب اسم الجمع معانو ما يصير نحن نلبس فغدي وخلي الفغدي الثانية يعني هذا دائما يجي twice أو plural jeans إذا عندي number three three اللي هي أيضا boots boots هوني أيضا plural يعني عندي زوج من الأبواب and finally five five اللي هو rain boots rain boots also uh, they are plural so we have singular items and the ashia uh, appears in the pictures they are singular or one thing and also we have nouns are plural uh, they are more than one thing كتبنا ارقام الصور اللي يشير الى المفرد والى الجمع write the numbers in the boxes now we have written احنا كتبنا الان ارقام الصور اللي يشير الى the singular nouns and the plural nouns now, خلينا نعمل زوم نشوف المحادثة ما بين uh, باسم. Here we have a conversation between باسم and هبة. Uh, they use a form يستخدمون صيغة to ask about the material حتى نسأل عن مصنعية الشيء. So باسم asked هبة, what's the jug made of? هلا من ماذا مصنوع الجج الزجاجي? What's the jug? Made of مصنوع من Made of مصنوع من إذا من ماذا الجج مصنوع من She answered It's made of glass It's made of glass إنه مصنوع من الزجاج طبعا she uses its استخدمت هوني its in the answer why because he he asked about singular قد يسأل عن شيء مفرد اللي هو الجج يعني ما قال جمع قال one jug only singular then she answered it's it's made of glass إنه مصنوع وعطت مادة الصنع اللي هي الجلاس then she asked him another question but, but here she used uh, the plural form she said what are the jeans made of what are the jeans made of لاحظوا كلمة jeans قلنا وردت بصيغة الجمع when I want to ask about the material من أجي أسأل عن مصنعيته We should use are in the question We don't say what is No We say what are What are uh, the genes يعني الجينز عندي جمع فأسأل ب are What are the genes made of من ماذا مصنوع الجينز He answered طبعا he didn't use it is ما قال it is made of He, say, he said they are They are لاحظوا they are استخدم بالجابة ليش؟ لأنه because she asked him about genes genes اللي هي جمع وعندي استخدمت are فبالإجابة also in the answer you should say they are made of وبعدين تعطي مادة الصنع اللي هي denim قماش قطني what are the genes made of they are made of denim إذا راح نستخدم هذا ال هذا ال question أو this form to ask about uh, the material حتى أسأل عن مصنعية الشيء uh, لازم أستخدم هذه هذا الكوشن. What's the jug made of? 
It is made of glass. إذا نستخدم هون is والجاك singular جاوبت ب it's وعطت المادة الصنع. بينما هي سألت what are the genes made of? She uses are and the because the genes plural. And he then he answered they are they are made of denim. Uh, استخدم أيضا صيغة plural. He didn't say it is. He said he said they are because genes نعتبر uh, هذه uh, plural form. إذن هذا عندي صيغة السؤال. إذن نرجع مرة ثانية إلى page 23. We will use this formula to ask about the material. إحنا نستخدم هذه الصيغة للسؤال عن مصنعية الشيء. Uh, عندي what's it made of؟ لماذا مصنوع؟ بس هوني is it. قلنا لي عندي المفرد. Or you can say what are they made of? What are they made of? من ماذا تصنع مجموعة أشياء يعني أشياء أو للجمع نستخدم are the singular نستخدم is. So what's what is it or uh, what are they made of? So now we will ask about these pictures. You should write the material under each picture. أنت بقى لازم تسجل مادة الصنع تحت كل صورة. We should determine the material for each picture or each item in the in this picture. So first, number one or picture one, I will ask about the material. We have uh, three things. We have a fork, shoka, knife, sikin, and a spoon. So when I want to ask about the material, what are they made of? This because I have three things in the plural. جمع. Then I say what are they made of? من ماذا تصنع هذه الأشياء? They are made of metal. Then you should write metal. راح تكتب إنها مصنوعة من المعدن. You should write metal under the picture. Number two, here we have shoes. Shoes. So because shoes قلنا نعمل معامل في plural دائما because we can't use uh, one shoe. Uh, when when we want to wear it, so shoes it's a plural form. So when we want to ask about the material, we say what are they made of? What are they made of? Uh, they are made of leather. They are made of leather. And then the first picture we say they are made of metal. They are made of metal and picture two we say they are made of leather made of معناتها مصنوع من إنها مصنوعة من الجد picture three also we have a plural أيضا عندي جمع because we have gloves gloves أيضا تعامل معاملة الجمع هذه هي shoes the gloves the boots لنعامل معاملة plural form so I say what are they made of we didn't say what is it made of because here we have a plural, not singular. So we say we say we can say what are they made of? They are made of wool. They are made of wool. إنها مصنوعة من الصوف. While picture four, we have singular, one dress and the dress who stand had a one dress. It's singular. So we said what is it made of? What is it made of? لماذا مصنوع هذا الفستان؟ Is it 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 means the, the dress or we can say what is the dress made of? What is the dress made of? In the answer I will say uh, it is made of cotton. إنه مصنوع من القطن. طبعا أنتم طلابي لازم تسجلون المادة الصنع تحت الصور. يعني follow me and write the material under each item or under each picture. So the dress is made of cotton. And the fustan must not mean cotton. Picture five here, as you see, we have pencil case. Pencil case. So I'm going to ask about the material. It is singular. So I say, what is it made of? What is it here? Singular. The pencil case. Or what is the pencil case made of? It is made of wood. إنها مصنوعة من الخشب. 
it is made of wood. We have six. Six, we have many colored bands. Many colored bands, يعني أربطة مطاطية ملونة. Then هوني plural. It's not singular. ما مفرد هذه جمع. Then we will ask what are they made of? Or I can say what are the bands made of? لماذا تصنع هذه الأربطة? In the answer, I say they are they are made of rubber. إنها مصنوعة من المطاط. They are made of rubber. Now, picture seven, we have this is a bottle or a jug. It's a bottle or a jug. Uh, what's it made of? What's it made of? It's made of a glass. This jug or this bottle is made of a glass. إنه مصنوع من الزجاج. And finally, number eight. عن هون الطلاب هذه ما جاج هذه bottle هذه this is not jug this is bottle so we can say uh, this bottle is made of a glass number eight what's the the jacket made of هذه عندي مفرد the jacket so what's what is it made of ماذا مصنوعة هذه jacket jacket it is made of what it is made of denim إنها مصنوعة من القماش القطني هون لاحظوا الجنس نقول عليه نوع دينم نوع من الجنز أو القماش القطني so it is made of denim يعني من الشوفون جنز يقولون it is made of denim now in the first in the second activity he said listen to دانيا and باسم أصغي إلى دانيا وباسم talking about يتحدثون what they are wearing ماذا يرتدون label the pictures يعني أشر داخل الصور but after listen to track 17. So we will, we will, uh, Dania and Basim, they are talking about what they are wearing. By using the following track. The track, then we will mention uh, or label the picture. Track 17. Listen to Dania and Basim talking about what they are wearing. Label the pictures. I'm wearing a cotton t-shirt and a denim jacket. I'm wearing a cotton skirt and leather shoes. I'm wearing a woolen scarf, a cotton t-shirt, a leather jacket, denim jeans and leather boots. Now, we, after we complete listening to track 17, we will describe everyone uh, uh, what is he uh, is wearing. So, Dania, Dania is wearing, uh, Dania Tertedi, a cotton t-shirt. This is a cotton t-shirt. Yani, uh, a shirt, a t-shirt, a cotton t-shirt. And we describe the t-shirt as a cotton. A cotton t-shirt, يعني t-shirt قطني. A cotton t-shirt. لازم تذكر مادة الصنع قبل ال ال object. The material then the object. A cotton t-shirt. Look at here. A a cotton t-shirt. We use the article a because t-shirt is singular. لاحظوا هوني t-shirt مفرد. So we can say a a cotton t-shirt. The jacket. What about the jacket? It's a denim jacket. A denim jacket. She is wearing هي ترتدي a denim jacket. يعني jacket مصنوعة من قماش قطني. And also here we say a a denim jacket because jacket is singular. Also, Dania is wearing a cotton skirt. A cotton skirt. يعني تنورة قطنية. A a we use a because skirt is singular. لاحظوا skirt مفرد. طريقة حط ال a a cotton skirt. And finally, she's wearing leather shoes. Leather shoes. يعني حذاء جلدي. Here we didn't say a or an. Why? ما قلنا a leather. Why? Because shoes we said as this. It's it's considered as plural. هاي راح نعتبرها كجمع. We said that shoes, gloves, عندي ال jeans, boots, trousers, all of these. Uh, things are uh, 
considered as a plural form. هذول نعتبرهم أو نعامل معاملة الجمع. So we can't put a or an before plural. As we said before, مثل ما قلنا مسبقا إنه نحن ما نطيق نحط الـ آ والآن قبل الجمع. إذا we said uh, leather shoes. Leather shoes يعني حذاء جلدي. Now we are uh, going to describe uh, Basim what is he wearing. So he is wearing a woolen scarf. A woolen scarf يعني وشاح أو لفاحة woolen صوفية. لاحظ woolen صوفي as adjective only. استخدمت a مع scarf because singular. A cotton t-shirt. A cotton t-shirt يعني t-shirt قطني. A cotton t-shirt. A leather jacket. This is leather يعني jacket جلدية. A leather jacket and jacket is singular. So we can say a. لازم نسبقها بآ يعني jacket مفرد. A leather jacket. لاحظوا احنا ايش عم نذكر؟ عم نذكر مادة الصنع وبعدين نذكر اسم الشيء. عم نوصفه. A leather jacket يعني jacket جلد. Denim jeans. Denim jeans يعني بنطلون جنس من قماش قطني. We didn't say a or an. Why? Because jeans uh, it considered as a plural. هذه jeans نعتبرها هوني جمع. فما يصير أسبق بـ a or an. And finally we have leather boots. Leather boots يعني boot جلدي. Also here boots. هذه boots هي uh, considered as a plural. We didn't say a or an. ما نسبق لا أبا ولا بـ an. يعني عندي boots جمع. بس هوني أرجع وأذكر هذه كلمة jug. This is not jug here. We have Bottle. Now, what are the grammatical things in this lesson? If I ask you the rules that are required from this lesson, I have the use of the question. What is it made of? What is it made of for singular? For singular items, the things that are separate, I use what is it. What is it made of? بال answer بالجواب حدث طبعا what I say it is made of then you will determine the material. يعني تحدد مادة الصنع. So in in here we have a picture of a jug and we have a picture of a dress. Examples. Number one, what is the jug made of? Do you see the jug here? I'm asking about the material. What is the jug made of? من ماذا مصنوع الجج هذا؟ بالجواب راح يكون يكون مفرد الإجابة مالي. It is made of glass. It is made of glass. إنه مصنوع من الزجاج. إذا استخدمت الصيغة الأولى اللي هي للمفرد. What is it made of? It is made of. وحدد مادة الصنع. من عدكم شيء مفرد. أنت بتستعملون الصيغة هذه اللي هي للمفرد. What is it made of? Or you can say What is the jug made of? It is made of وحدد مادة الصنع. Number two, What is the dress? What is the dress made of? It is made of cotton. What is the dress made of? من ماذا مصنوع الفستان? It is made of cotton. إنه مصنوع من القطن. إذا لاحظ هوني عندي singular. One dress and one jug. فلهذه الحالة أنا أستخدم هذه الصيغة بالسؤال. للسؤال عن the material يعني مادة الصنع. What is it made of? While when I have plural things such as uh, jeans, such as uh, boots, leather boots or uh, rubber rain boots. إذا راح أستعمل صيغة ثانية للجمع. اللي هي what are they made of what are هون استخدمت are بالسؤال while we use is before in the previous situation بالحالة الأولى استخدمنا is while the second situation we use are what are they made of لماذا مصنوعة هذه الأشياء اعتبرها أو عاملة معاملة الجمع اللي هو الجينز قلنا البوتس الرين بوتس الشوز الجلوبز The trousers, كل هذه نعتبرها plural. They are الإجابة. They are, they are. 
يعني هون اللي انا سالته بار الجواب بار ايضا سو ذي ار ميد اوف بحدد ماده الماتيريال بحدد ماده الصنع اكزامبلز وات ار ذا جينز ميد اوف وات ار ذا جينز ميد اوف لماذا مصنوع هذا الجينز استخدمت ار بالسؤال هون عندي اعتبرناه بلورال الانسر ذي ار ميد اوف دنم they are made of denim مصنوعة من القماش القطني أو الجينز القطني number two what are the rain boots هذه ال rain boots اللي هو البوت المطري أيضا استخدمت R بالسؤال what are the rain boots made of what are the rain boots made of they are made of rubber they are made of rubber إنها مصنوعة من المطار إذا عندي two forms of questions The first one for singular. الصيغة الأولى للمفرد. What is it made of? It is made of واحد مادة الصنع. طبعا هذه راح تجيني على شكل توصيل. يخلي لي الصيغة في السؤال في في جانب. والإجابة it is made of في جانب آخر. أما الصيغة الثانية اللي هي for plural. What are they made of? They are made of واحد مادة الصنع الماتيريال. We have very important notes. لاحظوا هاي ملاحظة مهمة جدا. I have two words. اللي هو wooden, woolen. Wooden يعني خشبي. Woolen يعني صوفي. رح يجي بعد noun. الاسم اللي أغيب أو صوفي. For example, I say a wooden spoon. ملعقة خشبية. A woolen sweater. Blues صوفي. إذا هير وودن أند وولن they come as adjective هذولي جوني كصفة هوني كصفة جوني هذا وصف بيها a wooden uh, spoon and a woolen sweater wooden and woolen after that we should put noun حجيب اسم الشيء اللي أنا قد أوصفه while when I have the form it is they are made of من تشوفون هذه الصيغة it is made of إنه مصنوع من or they are made of إنها أو للجمع مصنوعة من we cannot use wooden and woolen we say wood and wool هوني جوني كماتيريال يعني هوني جوت نينم كماتيريال كناونز يعني أسماء مواد وليست صفات I say it is made of wood إنه مصنوع من الخشب they are made of wool إنها مصنوعة من الصوف يعني when you have This statement. The man in the case of the word "made of," when you see this word, you cannot say "wooden" or "woolen." But with these two elements, the rest of the materials are the same. It is made of glass. It is made of rubber. It is made of cotton. But only the words "wood" and "wool" it comes in two ways. 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 بعدها راح يجيني الاسم هوني راح اوصف بيها فاضيف له هوني اي ان وودن ضفت الاي ان وولن هوني ضفت ال اي ان وي يوز ذيم از ادجكتيف هوني استخدمناهم كصفه يعني اقول ملعقه خشبيه بلوز صوفي وايل وين وي هاف ذيس ستيتمنت لكن لما عندي هاي العباره ات از ميد اوف وود إنه مصنوع من الخشب هوني راح نستعملهم as noun كماتيريال يعني مادة صنع or they are made of uh, wool they are made of wool and the following examples uh, will show me this note uh, in details عندي هذول المثالين راح يوضحوا لي يوضحون هذه القاعدة number one the scarf is made of wool الوشاح مصنوع من وول الصوف لاحظوا من جتني عبارة ميد اوف اذا انا راح استعمل كلمة وول او وود اذا انا جتني هاي العبارة the scarf is made of wool الوشاح مصنوع من الصوف number two she is wearing انها ترتدي a woolen scarf هوني جتني كصفة وصفت بها السكارف وسبقت كلمة scarf Then here in the first example we have wool as a material, while in the second example we use it as adjective. She is wearing a woolen scarf.
يعني من تجيني ميد اوف احط ماده الصنع بينما من تجيني كصفه تسبق الاسم another examples the chair is made of wood we cannot say is made of wooden no ما نستخدم الادجكتيف بعد made of we use the material the chair is made of wood ان الكرسي مصنوعه من الخشب but if i want to describe the chair i say it is a wooden chair غدت اوصفها اقول it is a wooden chair انها كرسي خشبية it's a wooden chair نعيد بس نكبر الأمثلة لاحظ الفرق the scarf is made of wool نقلنا من تجيني عبارة made of راح استعمل أما كلمة wool أو wood we don't use wooden or woolen then we use them as a material راح نستخدمهم كمادة صنع while number two she is wearing إنها ترتدي I want to describe the scarf أريد أوصف الوشاع I say a woolen scarf هوني راح أستخدم as woolen as adjective كصيفة uh, The first or the uh, third example The chair is made of wood إن الكرسي مصنوعة من الخشب Made of تعمل فيه wood هوني كماتيريال While if I want to describe the chair I say it is a wooden chair It's a wooden يعني خشبية إنها كرسي خشبية إذن هذا كان عندي في Lesson 1 The Grammar Things What is it made of? What are they made of? والفرق ما بين wooden, woolen, wood and wool So your homework is just to study the spelling لازم تحفظون إملاء the materials تحفظون إملاء مواد الصنع مع التنزيل طبعا Remember the materials تذكر مواد الصنع materials المواد They are uh, cotton, it means al-cotton, uh, wool, al-suf, we have wood, al-khashab, we have also leather, al-jil, uh, glass, al-zujaj, and metal, al-ma'dan, we have also denim, al-jenz al-qutni, al-qimash qutni, and we have rubber, al-matat, then uh, this, these are the materials you should study the spelling for these words تدرسون املاء هذه المفردات مهمه جدا بالunit وايضا نزلوا لي هذه المفردات على الدفتر so that's the end of our uh, lesson this is the end of our uh, lesson thanks for uh, your uh, listening and have a nice time uh, your english teacher uh, miss fan